All right, so welcome back. Hoping you're having a fabulous day here today. We actually got something pretty weird. Yeah, uh, me personally, I didn't expect this one bit, but this is happening, okay? What this tells us is this is a plan for the future. Keep this in mind. If you are looking towards banner systems, um, this is a change for it, right? Not like a change from the norm, just an addition to the norm, I guess you could say, right? With that being said, let's jump into this. If you're new to the channel, like it, subscribe. Helps out a ton. This is the next banner, which, again, you'll be freaked out, but this is it. Let's jump there. Yeah, it's it's Alice. We're going to be getting an Alice banner, okay? Now, what is the reason we're getting an Alice banner? I'm guessing they just want you to dupe her out or obtain her for the first time, okay? Looks like this is a new thing coming to the game. I know this is not April Fool's. It's definitely a week after April Fool's. Can't say that, but... Yeah, it, this was tweeted a few minutes ago. I was like, if it's an error tweet, they'll delete it. But clearly, they made the whole asset saying it's a pick of recruitment. Though, it, this did not get leaked, which I'm shocked. I, I thought at least we'd catch this. They didn't, okay? So, either they uh, tightened up some of the leaks and fixed that up. Um, but this was not known. I do believe so. Um, but it looks like we will get Alice as a pick of recruitment. Yeah? So, I was just editing the video, and I put two and two together. Don't tell me the reason they are doing this, and the reason they are releasing this character, is because of Easter. You see the rabbits? Don't tell me that this was the reason they're doing it. The bunny, it's Easter right now. So is she is she only for Easter and we're never going to get future characters like this? Is that what it is? Or is it like, oh, future characters will still be obtainable, right? So I don't know. I, I talk about in the in the rest of this video, I do talk about how this could help a lot of people. A guaranteed pilgrim where it's like, oh... I can't get Scarlet. For my life, I can't pull Scarlet. They put a rate up for Scarlet one day. Boom. I can obtain that character now. That's great, right? Now, let's say that's not the case. And they just do it this way where it's, oh, because she's Easter, we dropped her. Then why did you make an Easter character? If that's, if that's the reason. If it's just because it's Easter, huge L. If it's because they want people to obtain the character in the future on rate up because they've been suffering miserably and crying every single day that they can't obtain their favorite character, W. Which one? I wonder, actually. I mean, it gives you an idea that in the future, you could get pilgrims on a thing, right? So it is cool. It is right. I am mad and furious that they definitely could have squeezed out one of the NPC characters as an additional banner here or there. They didn't, right? So, you know, I hope that this doesn't, like, screw it over permanently that you get, you know, two banners every update. One's an old character. One's a new character. And in the future, you just continuously get NPC characters um, I do think that when they handle events as like a three week event and do two banners during the three weeks, it's kind of fine because you either choose one of the characters. Usually you don't choose both. You choose one of them and then go for that one you like. But, um, you know, I mean, maybe, maybe I'm just salty still that aid is NPC jailed. And so is the other like two that were really cool. So maybe it's just me, but hey, I can't win. Right. But it looks like this is a new mechanic coming to the game where uh, they'll take an old character, throw her onto the uh, a new banner, and then allow you to pull for that character, right? We don't have date timings, we don't have any of that sort, and this is why they tweeted yesterday for the other character, which was D, right? D was shown yesterday for the reason that they're gonna tweet this today. So I told you, like, it's very, it's really awkward. They should not have tweeted um, the character announcement that early. That means that there's either a second banner or something else, but we know that K's not a character, so I don't want to give that copium and lie to you, like, oh, K could drop, but um, yeah, they tweeted it early. So the reason they tweeted it early was, in fact, because Alice was coming. Um, so again, in the future, I'm hoping that this also is done for pilgrims. Mainly, that is what people need. Um, but you can see banners like uh, Leader, right? A lot of people need her. She's a great character. They do it for her. This allows you to get the ML, like the basically level of the character, right? Dupes of the character, right? So that is good too. But um, in the future, yeah, this is a thing. So maybe every two weeks we get one banner for a character uh, that already exists in the game, which again, good system. It helps crack that wall, gets you a character you've been looking for. Let's say you've been looking for leader and you just haven't pulled leader and you can never pull leader. Why would you continuously like jump, uh, dump, uh, dump gems basically into the main banner when you can just dump gems here on a rate of banner for her specifically, correct? Or really sets you up for the thing of, okay, in the future, this could help me. This could really break me. Um, it depends on what you want to do with it. Uh, though, again, it it's if it's for a character that you know you need, okay? If it's for a character you know you need, you're more than welcome to dump gems into it. Uh, will you be able to pity the character now? We have to find that out too. Like, can you just use your guaranteed pity and pick up Alice, pick up uh, uh, Scarlet, pick up um, Modernia, like an old character, right? Like, they get the rerun or something like that. Um, pick up a character like, uh, who else? Snow White, right? 
can you guarantee the character through this would be a pretty cool system though again it has to be higher than the rate up the rate up is also existing uh where it's the witch that's function right so this theoretically has to be a higher rate than that right i believe the rate up function is doing that so this is a two percent which i don't think the rate up is even close so and yeah this is clearly a 0.2 percent so you can kind of see that your chance of getting let's say leader is pretty abysmal in comparison to going on to this banner right here let's say this banner was for leader and boom you went and pulled you're at two percent so most of the time this is going to actually help a lot of players it is good it's just i hope in the future they don't like oh we have two banners active already so in the future we'll never actually do multiple banners we'll keep it to uh, the one npc character one playable character or two npc characters one playable character i hope that isn't a change because i did like the you know the last event we had right which was uh the outsiders not like the last one but back then right the outsiders had two characters there were two good characters no one was npc jails right after that you had the valentine's one you know aid got npc whatever other characters happened but hopefully they don't just like you know cut it off like oh we already have too many banners in the game at a time so we're gonna do it that way that's why the the npc character started who knows right I'm, I'm just talking out loud here right but um yeah pretty cool feature again in the future this can help you out a crap ton and i'm hoping pilgrim banners also drop right not that it's the only function for characters that are just on the wish list to give it to you remember it's that type of idea it can definitely help a lot of players guarantee the character get dupes for said character and like let's say it's a character like alice you have and you're about to crack the 160 wall you're super close alice needs one more dupe and now rather than dumping those gems into now the clearly worst banner being the wishlist banner you dump those gems here get a guaranteed copy of alice and you break that wall right so it is a good change it is pretty you know semi uh in my head working again i don't know what the community opinion here uh, on this right now is could be very angry comments. I, I could see that right now. But I think that this is a great step in the right direction of giving a chance to guarantee the character. Though, again, I don't know what people are going to say. So, <laughs> I'm done for if this is a bad one. But could be a bad take. I definitely could have a bad take here today, right? But, again, on the side, you do have D dropping. That's happening, too. You don't have K dropping. She's not a character. Um, so, that, like, rumor that's been floating around. Because, again, I wasn't the only one that said that. I did see a lot of people on Discord mention, like, oh, they tweeted this early. Does that mean K is coming soon? That's, like, tomorrow's banner going to be announced. Uh, that that rumor is now put to rest completely, 100%, stabbed to death, right? So that's there. Uh, for all those people that wanted K as a character, it's not happening anymore. Uh, full birthday is also going on. Just make sure you get that done. Uh, they are teasing more stuff for the uh, the half anniversary. Uh, so, no, this is not your half anniversary character. I did see a few comments in the tweet over uh, when it dropped um, that that is the case, but... Keep in mind, co is also active. Make sure you get your matches in and get those done uh, before it does leave because you don't want to miss out on any rewards. Pretty cool. Um, that's there also. And that's really with the update. Um, we should get patch notes uh, tomorrow night, right? So tomorrow night is patch notes. Uh, later today, we might also see some more uh, teasers and event information for that half anniversary stuff. There is a stream going down. I'll try and make a full video like where I show you everything that was given to us. Uh, but there is a stream going down. It is on the 22nd or the 21st, the 21st of this month. Stay tuned for that. I'll give you a full breakdown of um, everything when that drops and we get closer to it. Uh, so keep that in mind. That's happening. Half anniversary in the corner. It's pretty cool. You know what I mean? It is pretty cool. So peace out and enjoy. Spin it for me.